this year for 2013, Dunlop's got some new US Buffalo made Dunlop race tires that we're running on the back of these big 1000 Yamahas. From the UK tires that we raced in 2012 to the new US based tires in 2013, you know, one of the big things that we're seeing is consistency over race distance has improved from the previous tires. That's really paid big dividends having these US tires, and it's made my life a little bit easier because the bike's not as hard to ride at the end of the race. The riders always ask for one thing, and that's more grip. Uh, more side grip, more edge grip, uh, more drive grip. And so that's the biggest uh, factor that we work on while still having something that's gonna last. So we have to find a compromise between good grip and something that's gonna go race distance. Uh, a lot of the uh, fast laps this year is gonna come right at the last lap of the race. This year, comparing to last year with uh, with edge grip and stuff, I feel like it has similar edge grip. I feel like the rear tire has a little bit more drive grip than last year. Um, but yeah, I feel like you can push the tires a little harder this year, so it's good. This year, with uh, the new Dunlop tires on, I was able to, to get the track record at the, the last two tracks I've raced at, which is uh, a really big accomplishment for me. Uh, this year's been going a lot better, and yeah, the tires have allowed me to, to push, just to take it to that next level, so yeah, it's good. A lot of the technology and carcass design and tread compound work end up in the Q3 and our street tires. Even up to our Superbike slick level, it shares a common compound with our Q3 tires, uh, and the constructions are, are remarkably similar. You know, having raced on the, on the imported tires for so many years that I've been here in this AMA paddock, this new US-based tire, some of the, the truly added benefits for one are the cost not having to bring tires in from outside of the country it reduces costs and gets more racers to the racetrack and makes the weekend a little bit easier. On top of that, it makes quicker availability, I think, to the club racers, and their input also helps. Numbers always help, but also the development can happen really, really quickly. Where when we need a new tire, in only a couple of weeks' time, we can be testing something new and developing it further, which is just gonna make our tires get better faster and we're going to be on better, quicker tires in the very foreseen future.